This time on Air Arms TV, we travel deep into the heart of the Karoo in the Eastern Cape of South Africa. We'll be dealing with a pest problem on a farm situated in the Middleburg area. The farm we'll be hunting on deals in both wild game breeding and hunting, as well as livestock. The property is simply breathtaking, with rolling hills, deep valleys, wide open plains and beautiful meandering rivers. Not only will this hunt be challenging, but an experience of a lifetime. While well, we woke up to a beautiful morning out here on the mountains, there's a little bit of cloud cover, some rain, but it's looking promising. Hopefully it does clear up a little bit later on. And today we're heading out into the fields close to the farmhouse, and we're gonna be focusing in on ground squirrels. The thing about the ground squirrels is that they make holes, causing animals at night to step in, and uh, sometimes injure themselves or break their legs. So really looking forward to it. Let's get out there, do some good hunting and hopefully get some of those ground squirrels today. The Cape ground squirrel, quite an interesting little critter. These rodents are found in South Africa. They can grow up to 45 centimeters in length and weigh up to one kilogram. Look at this one there. Ah, oh, he's just feeding on the top there. He hasn't seen us yet, so we've got a wall right over here. We can use the wall as cover. That will be quite easy. Let's, let's go, let's go. Having this wall here is a real bonus, one I'm planning on taking full advantage of. I just know the squirrel won't see me for most of the stalk. He's right here, like 20 yards. Let's go, let's go. He's gonna see us. He's right here. I'm gonna have to sit up on my, I'm gonna have to sit up on my bum. Man, that was flipping awesome. I cannot believe he was facing the other way. Wind's coming this way, perfect. Oh, that was freaking cool. Let's go and have a look. You know, although these are vermin and uh, small game and the farmer wants to get rid of them, I tell you, the fun factor in that stalk was absolutely phenomenal. Managed to sneak around the brush, boom, straight down. I am super pumped about that, but there's a whole lot more around. We've got more hunting to do today, so let's get going. I just love it when a plan comes together, and with such an epic start to the day, I'm sure we're going to have a very successful hunt. Yeah, check this out, here we go. Look at these holes. There's one there, here's another one over here. Have a look, check how deep this one is. Yeah, we. It runs right down. You see, this is exactly why the farmers asked us to come out. There are holes all over this area, and the sheep, the goats, the horses, all the livestock are all around these pastures. So um, it's just so easy for them to, you know, in the heat of things, maybe they're running from a jackal or even just going about their nighty business, and boom, foot goes in there. And Ben, look at the sharp rocks on the edge of the hole here. You can see this is definitely a problem in this area and the reason why they've called us in. We're going to head on just a little bit over the ridge. I know there's some holes there and hopefully we can get some more. Let's go. Let's go see him. 
So he should be over here. There he is. So just a bit of a white tuft from his tail. It always gives them away. Look at that. Okay, oh, fantastic. A nice headshot. That's exactly what we wanted. But uh, yeah, let's uh, not spend too much time. Let's get moving. Yo, there's a whole colony there. That's awesome. Now we're gonna have enough cover now. Still there. And number three, still there. Oh, he's just sticking around. Let's go for the third one. That is our first. Three in a row, straight down. Oh man, let's go check them out. Come, let's go, let's get out of here. Yeah, that is exactly what we've been trying to do. Have a look at this. Um, basically culled a whole family unit. So that's just what we're looking for. Um, if you have a look here. All right, here's the, here's the male. And then uh, over here is the female. And then here is a, a younger male. Yep, that's right. So there you go. One, two, three. That's exactly what we were trying to do here. We're looking really good today. We've taken uh, about five of them, so uh, I think we're going to call it a day. We'll see you guys next time on Air Arms TV.